Good morning, beautiful people! Welcome back to Liu Live Everything and Wonder. If you're new here, we are Luca and Sara from Liu Live Everything and Wonder. We traveled from Alaska to Argentina with an $800 old truck camper. And when we returned to Italy, we converted our minivan Luigi into a beautiful tiny home on wheels to be able to explore more of this beautiful world. Please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel to enjoy the adventures of a curious Italian couple. For the past few weeks, we have been traveling with our minivan Luigi across Italy. You know, this is a channel about traveling, but we also love working on do-it-yourself projects. We are now back at Lucky Land, our property in Piemonte region in Italy, where we have this little cottage in the mountains that needs a lot of love. After finishing our guest room slash baby room, where we install a Murphy bed, today we are working to get a step forward to finish and complete our bedroom. So stay tuned and see which kind of solution we will choose to save space and to make this room livable and enjoyable. It's a blast to see for the first time this room empty, empty, empty. After several years. Okay, so we are super excited. Let's start. Let's start. We have already our wardrobe, our white, beautiful wardrobe. Then we have this little wardrobe here. In the future, we will build our working station, so a table with two seats where we can edit and work on our videos. What we need to, to complete is this wall. We don't have the bed. We don't know what to do with this wall. In order to understand uh, where we want uh, to turn on and off the lights. Now we will build, install, assemble the bed. So when we have the bed done, we know where we want to place the plugs to plug the phone, where we want to turn on and off the lights, and where to install our night stands. This will not be a classic bed. This will be a bed without the headboard and will be a bed with the storage. Luca, yes. what are you doing? I'm trying to decipher it. I'm trying to read the instructions. Are you reading the instructions? Kind of. Oh, really? I mean, I'm watching the, the images. Do you need my help? Of course, always. I need your support. Sometimes uh, do-it-yourself projects can be a workout. So we would like to say a huge thank you to Gym Plus Coffee for sponsoring today's video. Gym Plus Coffee is an Irish athleisure and lifestyle brand with a focus on building an amazing community with a very important mission, make life richer. Whether you are working out, uh, going for a hike, uh, relaxing at home, uh, or working on some do-it-yourself projects, uh, Gym and Coffee's clothing has you covered for all occasions. These two are my favorite items. I have chosen this set because first of all I love the color. I love the high quality material and being five and a half months pregnant is super important to me to feel comfortable, cozy and especially the jogger, they are very very comfortable. I'm really an active 
mom to be so I love to help Luca I love to cook I love to work on some do-it-yourself projects and I know that with this set I can also go outside go shopping and I could feel beautiful I chose these jokers and this hoodie because uh, I like uh, that when uh, I move I bend uh, I stay nice and cover and plus I can move uh, as I want uh, and I feel free, I feel comfortable, I can go outside and feel nice and warm, come inside and breathe uh, and I don't sweat, uh, so this is perfect uh, for what I need. And what we love is that they are working on 100% fully compostable packaging. Click the link in our description box below and use our code Liu, L -E -A -W, to get 20% off your first order with Gym Plus Coffee. We really recommend you to get these beautiful joggers and hoodies, uh, you will not regret it. Thanks again to Gym Plus Coffee for sponsoring today's video and now let's get back to work. start to see the size of the bed you can see that it's really high because we will have a huge storage space underneath the bed now it's time to install this kind of brackets that hold uh, the bed so up here we will have the mattress and down here it will be all storage a lot of storage down there what we will have on wood cladding uh, on the wall behind the bed and then we need to study a solution for the lights and for the floating nightstands we would like to have everything wood so we can really see the contrast between the white of the bed and the wood paneling of the wall this is the lifting bed mechanism that will allow us to lift the bed easily time to put the bed base uh, without it's not slatted yet because first we need to install this and then we have to put all the slats <laughs> And now it's time to put the slats on the bed. beautiful people we came running at this place because uh, 
we saw this uh, really good deal buying uh, 10 of these uh, wood uh, structures uh, for plants uh, for uh, 10 euro meaning one euro each so we had to run here and get this uh, and also this uh, three centimeters uh, plywood uh, boards uh, for seven euro each so we came running here and it's good uh, that we build uh, a modular van uh, that we can take everything off uh, and you can see how these are 120 for 180 centimeters uh, and there are 20 pieces so you can see how many things we can fit uh, in the van uh, when we take out the bed and everything from inside we bought also what we need to complete the room today yes hopefully we have everything we need uh, so Fli we don't need to come back <laughs> and buy more stuff but we always forget something that little detail that you can you need to come back and buy something else now let's, let's go. go and work on our bedroom bravo luigino bravo really gray today this is the stock area with all the offers okay now let's go back to lucky land and we are back home guys i would like to show you the current situation so we have our bed here ready now we need to take some measurements to see where we would like to put our floating nightstands and then here we empty the van so we have the bed here everything here now Luca is unloading the van we will put everything back in Luigi so we have this free again I'm so happy that we have started this project we slept in our bedroom only for a few months last year and then we had the mold problem first we we travel Italy with Luigi then we had the mold problem in the winter and then we slept in the living room in front of the fireplace and then we move to the guest room because we had the bed ready we cleaned the kitchen we cleaned the living room we've cleaned everything we have donated so much items so much stuff clothes everything so we are really happy and i can't wait to sleep in our bedroom sarah already chose this one will be the top of her nightstand this will be mine and then uh, we will be building them uh, so we were thinking the design about it this is from the front front view and upper view yeah drone view it will be like this there will be also a socket um Just on it on the side we will not use this one anymore this one will disappear and uh, it will be on the side of sarah's uh, nice stand so it's nice and easy to use and then once we decide the position we can start working with um, the wood cladding exactly trying to see if we want the nightstand at 80 centimeters from the floor or 85 centimeters from the floor so like it's, this uh, it's 85 okay <laughs> like this is 80 it's not a big difference i was going with the nightstands they are quite hard to to build uh, i thought it would be easy but uh, i don't have the right uh, screws uh, the right tools uh, to do a really good detail 
you know, finish touch, but yeah, and then I'm it's doing so my small. best. Yes. So small, and but you're doing a great job. Yeah. I'm sure you will do it, like always. We decided 85, 85 each side. Now we are about to install five uh, wood buttons that will support uh, the wood cladding. We will nail gun the wood cladding on this. So let's start. Uh, we have a lot of drilling to do here. And this is the result guys it's already dark outside it's 7 30 p.m we were thinking we could be faster but the night stands are very difficult to build and to make while luca is outside i will go downstairs and i will cook some dinner some soup i try to help as much as i can but i noticed that every half an hour Every one hour I need to rest a little bit and sit down because, yes, my body, this is what my body needs in this moment. This is behind, uh, behind the scenes and this is the front part. You can see the cut, uh, how hard it is to cut it. Yeah. I put also some glue so it will not move. And this is upside down right now. Yes, it will. That's upside down. And then now we miss the the door that yes. will open. That Let will me be see. In the front. We will use the same inches that we use for Luigi. We'll go similar. One here, one over here. We need to put two holes on the. This will be the door that will go up and down, like this. And then we will put the the bottom the part. This is the moment where there is a mess everywhere and nothing is completed and you feel exhausted and overwhelmed but you know that it will be better. Hopefully. Hopefully. We'll have dinner, go to bed uh, and we will see you tomorrow. Ciao. Ciao. <laughs> Good morning guys and here we are again in the same bedroom in the same place and we hope that this will be the last day of our room renovation. Good morning beautiful people! We are about to hang our first nightstand over here. Before hanging it I will show you how it works. We have the front door with two hinges. We have a hole where the wires for the power sockets or the switch for the light will be right here. So easy to access from the bed. Inside we also have two stoppers and this will be the last time you will sit from inside. And then from here the hole we will not see the hole because it will be covered with the wood cladding. Yes, exactly. We have two centimeters of wood cladding. One is this one and the second one is the layer of uh, wood cladding, of course. Yesterday in the same shop where we bought the wood and the material we also found an amazing offer for two lamps. Five euro. It's incredible. 
incredible. They are very vintage. It looks like you are in an hotel, but they are modern at the same time. So this is what we liked. They call the silver color and the details really simple and minimal, elegant. We have started the wood paneling, guys, and it looks amazing! Now we had to move the bed <laughs> closer to the wall because we need to decide the position of the two lamps. And test. Sarah wanted to test it, so we had to put the bed, <laughs> fake uh, mattress, uh, to see the, the, the right height. Okay, can we test? Okay. Yes. So this is perfect, I already love it. Turn it on. Yeah, it's okay. It's comfy. Yeah. Comfortable. Mm -hmm. Not in the way if I want to put something here. It's comfortable. Remember doing this in Luigi, Sara? Of course. <laughs> Good memories. Now we are doing it in our house. I'm cutting them outside so I don't fill all the house with the sawdust. This is the hole for the lamp. So this side and Luca's side on the right will be difficult to make because you have to cut piece by piece. But then this in the middle will be like a piece of cake. We have been cutting 15 pieces on the right sides and it's time to rock and roll. Let's do it. works now we are working on this side how is everything going good good do you like the result i love it but now it's beautiful it looks like a cabin finally finally our cabin looks like a cabin <laughs> <laughs> i i don't believe it. It's the last piece, my love. Incredible. Beautiful. Yes. <laughs> We are super super happy with the result we love it we have done the wall paneling with the wood cladding then we have built two floating nightstands and we mounted this beautiful bed with the storage huge storage super useful on a budget for everything we have spent less than 500 euro so we are very included the, the bed exactly we have a question about this wood wood the color of the wood guys what do you think please comment below do you like this natural color because we bought a stain that is darker yes it's like the floor yes kind of kind of and we don't know now what to do because if you leave it like this uh, we will test uh, on some spare wood uh, 
and see if we like it. So please let us know in the comments if you like natural color or darker. We hope you enjoyed today's episode. If so, remember to smash the thumbs up button. Hit the notification bell and please consider subscribing to this YouTube channel if you haven't done already. It's really, and it's really important to us. The Italian words for today's video are Fatto a mano Handmade Fai da te Do it yourself Camera da letto Bedroom Fatto a mano Handmade Fai da te <laughs> Do it yourself <laughs> Camera da letto Bedroom, sorry guys, we are Super tired <laughs> Super tired, almost 11pm We need to have dinner still Take a shower and go to bed We love you, we appreciate you, thank you for coming along with us And thank you to Gym Plus Coffee for sponsoring today's video We will see you next Sunday and remember, la vita è bella. Life is beautiful. Ciao. Ciao. Step. A step forward. And where to install our night, night stands. And where to install our... You can shop online using the dedicated... <laughs> Back to work! Gyms and... Clothing... Project... Projects? Gym and coffee's clothing... You got this! But I think that we are good... I think... But um, but I think that we are good. It's time to move in now. <laughs> now it's time to rest a little bit up. <laughs> now it's time to put the slats under the bed, on the bed, Dai, in the bed, di nuovo. above the bed. Di nuovo. Dillo tu. Huh? And now it's time to. Dai, finish, finish. <laughs>